G'day guys, so quick update for you. It's Thursday here on the farm. We had a public holiday yesterday. It was Australia day, so uh, no one came in. We just uh, hung out with family, had a barbecue lunch. And so today we're back to it. We're all hands on deck and getting to back to work on that playground. Um, the playground is going to be for the puppies and the puppy program. Uh, we're building a purpose-built uh, adventure playground for them with a whole heap of stuff to climb on and play on and uh, learn some some coordination skills and just hang out as a nice safe environment for the pups so that we're getting back on track for building a playground and also a bit of an update on the Dane pups some of you might already might have already seen the post Sam did yesterday but all the Dane pups have been adopted and uh, we saw photos of them all with their new owners and I think all of them have got other dog siblings. Uh, a lot of them have kids in their family as well and all the dogs look real happy. And uh, so they got new names now. Uh, Mr. Blue is Bluey. Um, Miss, Miss Green is Daisy. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Orange is Roger. Miss Yellow is, what's Miss Yellow? Eddie. Eddie. And who are we missing? We're Miss missing Pink. one more. Miss Pink. Oh, yeah. Uh, what's Miss Pink's name? Luna. Luna, that's right. <laughs> it's cool. And so, they all look so happy in the yeah, photos. Yeah, don't they? They're all licking their face and it uh -oh. looks really, really cool. We're really, we're really uh, happy about the, you know, the way that this has all turned out. This has been the first full uh, puppy program from uh, all the first intake, really. And we've got two more litters here now. Uh, but... It was just all all round a you know a bit of a success to see the puppies come through, um, develop the way that they have, and then go to such loving homes. and And I think all of them are on on a bit of land too. So uh, we know that there's a couple that are still local here to us, um, but most of them have got plenty of room to run around. Uh, are they all on land? I'm not sure, but I know that several of them maybe. At least three are yeah. on rural property. Yeah, rural property, which, which is, is amazing. So cool. It's such a such a good place to end up. Yeah. Um, so really happy about that, and it's great, great uh, happy ending for those guys. And um, with them being local, who knows they're possibly going to uh, see them again uh, in the future. And uh, I got some mail today. I was a little bit surprised to see that there's a from our local council here. It's an Australian Day uh, nomination for an Australian Day award. So really uh, thankful to whoever voted or nominated me. I'm not sure if it was one or multiple, but um, that's really cool. Thank you very much for whoever nominated me. Um, yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty proud. So thanks guys. <laughs> Also, I want to say a quick thank you to these donors for helping us out with food and treats. So there's uh, Bob, Catherine, uh, Marianne, and Gaylene, and they're from all over the world. Uh, you know, USA, Canada, uh, United Kingdom. It's been really, really uh, good to help have that support to meet these guys. So thank you very much. And finally, I just want to talk about comments. Um, a lot of you have probably noticed that we turned comments off about a week ago um, and we're looking at bringing them back in a bit of a limited um, uh, situation. So some videos still won't have any comments available and then other videos will have comments turned on for, um, you know, around 12 or 24 hours to give everyone a chance to uh, still stay in touch with the community, uh, still put out their, their positive comments and um, be a part of this because it's a really uh, close-knit co community that we have and um, we don't want to take that away from everyone. Uh, but we do want to talk about you know the, the reason why we did it and why we go ahead this way for the future. Um, so Sam and her mum would be constantly monitoring the comments and blocking and hiding uh, comments so that it stayed positive and um, you know it's not all not just the trolling and negative comments that they were focusing on um, there's also quite a bit of uh, you know inaccurate information and misguided um, advice so you know, there were people were giving behavioral assessments and, you know, advice through comments threads to how to handle situations. And 
Um, it's definitely our, our, our uh, page uh, or channel is, is not that, uh, not for that kind of um, commentary or advice. It's, you know, when you're dealing with a, a dog that may have aggressive uh, tendencies or behavioral traits, um, you know, there's professionals out there that you should go and um, get advice from for your specific situation. Uh, rather than potentially taking on the wrong advice from someone who's made a comment about your situation who doesn't know you, doesn't know your, your dog or anything like that. So it, it, it can be quite dangerous if someone took that inaccurate information and tried to apply it in their own situation. Um, so that's one of the other things that we try to monitor and, and prevent. Uh, there's also a whole heap of other stuff, as everyone has probably aware, there's there's phishing scams and there's uh, you know other people jumping on trying to sell products or advertise businesses and, and that kind of thing. So um, the main reason why we're going to move forward with a limited time for commenting is the fact that this year we're focusing on our time and energy for the rescue work that we're doing. and with Sam and her mum pretty much full-time monitoring commentary, uh, you know, by limiting it, it allows, especially Sam, to get a lot more hands-on in helping me with the rescue work and, um, you know, bringing these videos to you about what's going on here at the farm, how the dogs are progressing, uh, rather than spending that extensive amount of time uh, monitoring comments, making sure it's all positive, uh, you know, and and really her energy and time is focused in what we've agreed to be the, the wrong place. Um, so it needs to be more focused around the dogs this year. We're gonna really put a lot of our time and energy to the rescue work. And so for that reason, uh, comments are going to be limited on any videos that they're available and some videos won't have comments at all. So I just wanted to clear that up for everyone. Um, so it's pretty exciting that comments will be coming back. We look forward to hearing all your positive comments. Um, but yeah, please try not to give out advice to people. Um, try not to, you know, stay positive. Try not to have a neg negative spin on it. Um, or you may be blocked. <laughs> I don't know what oh. I'm talking about. I, I think just on that though, the majority of our community who are subscribed to us um, yeah. or follow us are not not like that. We just want to make that clear. We know that the the really negative stuff is people who have just passing through passing through. It's the feed. first video that they've seen. We they we are, we know that. Any of the dog's names. They're, yeah, they have just, no idea about yeah. the context or the story. And, and those, those ones, like we take with a grain of salt. Yeah, there. absolutely. We know that that's, yeah. that's not the thing. But um, um, but the but the things that possibly might be um, within the community may be more the um, advice side yeah. of things. Um, it's okay to tell your story and your situation, um, but we don't want people to take advice from, you know, one size doesn't fit all. So we don't want someone to say, oh, this worked for me, and then someone apply it, and it be completely uh, wrong information and, and potentially toxic for whoever's taking that information. Um, like I know, for example, uh, a lot of, we had heaps of comments about shadow and you know behavioral assessments about the limited videos that we put up of her behavioral issues and they were all 100% wrong. Um, to the point where if people were to see this and say, oh, my dog behaves that way, um, I'll apply this to that. Um, that would be very dangerous. Yeah, it'd be very dangerous for, whoever's doing that um you know some some very like thing you know people are saying that um oh she's lead reactive yeah and she's only reactive because she's on lead which resource guard like yeah, the, all kinds of things being thrown out there and there's a whole heap of what we call you know inaccurate information it's it's blatantly wrong but it's people's opinions on the limited videos that they've seen um and so that's the kind of stuff that we do need to prevent getting out there because we don't want people to go, oh yeah, that makes sense, I'll, I'll do that, um, when they shouldn't. Um, you know, If you do need help with your dogs, uh, please reach out to a professional. Make sure the professional has worked with dogs that are similar to the issues that you're dealing with. 
um, and that's the best way to get help with your situation. Uh, even when people call me and, and ask me for advice. Um, it's Unless you've often, seen the dog in yeah, person. Yeah, it's often that uh, I can't give out any advice until I've observed the dog doing the behaviour because even the owners uh, misinterpret the behaviour and they, they say it's one thing but then as soon as I get there and see the dog I'm like no this is totally different, this dog's doing this because of X, Y and Z not A, B and C. Um, so it is very important that you get the right advice, it is very important that you don't take advice from commentary and that's why we focus on those type of comments and, and hiding them. We do have a forum for advice and giving out training tips and specific advice for uh, our followers and that's a, on our membership section in YouTube. There's, there's two membership groups. One is for dog training and technique uh, and strategy in training dogs and the other one is the behind the scenes uh, membership group on YouTube and uh, we do give out you know, specific tips and um, advice to people who ask questions and that kind of thing. We, we, we've set up a bit of a Q&A uh, style interaction where um, everyone in those groups can comment and we do videos answering all the comments. Um, people can ask anything. Yeah, they, they yeah. ask anything. We, we did one only a couple of days ago that uh, just answering all the questions took an hour and a half and we uploaded an hour and a half video of me answering all the questions and, yeah. and they can be anything like we're, we're quite open and honest about uh, everything um, you know we obviously don't put any of the stuff that shouldn't be public in the public forums but in these groups you know it is a safe um, supportive community so we do share a lot you know it can be anything like because people, that people ask one. people ask about our family yeah, you know our ask kids about the girls and, and you know their favorite things things they like to do their know, personalities school is, yeah, all, all kinds of things everything. that we then, wouldn't we wouldn't feel comfortable yeah we wouldn't put it sharing. out in the public and it's, forum and it's not it's not about our our followers and our positive community but it's the, more so these, protection for, for them really but. it is and and also um you know, in the in the public videos, um, that's that is where people pass through yeah. and make judgment that's and things right. like that. So it's a really safe space for us yeah. to share those more personal things. Yeah. Like, and people are asking all kinds of questions, anything from our family to yeah, all our, the way to finances and you know how we're funding the rescue work that we're doing. Um, and you know we feel that it's a safe environment to answer those questions, which is why the video was an hour and a half long. Um, and, and, they, and also it's it's also manageable for us, you know, because it is a small group. Um, yeah, it's a much smaller number to, you know, monitor and interact and, um, you know, handle that workload as far as comments and the interactions go. Um, and plus it's, like we said before, it's it, it's a much safer, supportive environment. For us um, to share that, for us kind, to of share that kind of information. So, um, yeah, the, pu the public space, you know, we don't give out advice or, or training tips or specific examples on how to handle certain things, but in the members section, we, we most certainly do. Um, you know. We we, sh we actually share a lot, don't we? Like, We're oversharers. <laughs> we, we are oversharers generally, like to, it, to uh, yeah. in the public forum, you know, but there are th there are some things and we're yeah. really hoping that people understand this, that that we just need a little bit more control over, yeah, um, you absolutely. know, that, that we only share in just a more controlled environment. Yeah. Um, and so, you know, but at but in that in that space, we are very we, open. We are like we are happy to answer you know any question like 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 we said finances personal like you know where did Sam and Luke meet yeah. like you know put spin out a few times <laughs> all that kind of stuff you know where's yeah. Jason um, you know but even things like you know where's what's the future of the farm and yeah. you know the stru Plans, the structure of staff you know, what's going on behind the scenes um, that's what's called behind the scenes but um, you know there's there's a lot of stuff that we we even confide in that group don't confide. we confide yeah we, we, we ask, ask their opinions ask information and, and you know what direction we should go that's what, right what sort of, i recently uh, put something out um yeah, you know about a children's book and, yeah. and what what they thought about that and and showed them some illustrations that i'd drawn which was very personal to me and i felt very vulnerable yeah. doing it but 
you know, they was, everyone was very supportive of it. And I think I needed that encouragement. Yeah. So we, we lean on, on, on that, that group. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, uh, whilst we do give out that advice and we do give out uh, tips, but it's not in the public forum. Uh, it's in a controlled, controlled environment yeah. on YouTube in our members section. Yeah. Uh, and we're not trying to sell it. Yeah. Um, you know, we we don't actually. <laughs> we, we, we we hardly ever it. mention we it. Heaps of people um, tell us that we should be pushing products and doing all sorts of stuff, but it's not our thing. No. Um, you know. But we are bringing it up here because, um, you know, a lot of people have contacted us about the comments yeah. and we do want to be open about how we're trying to manage it and structure it. Yeah. And this is a part of it yeah. um, all, with this, these Q&A a big... sessions in, in a more private space. So, um, you know... But the Q&A sessions, are, I think that uh, they're going down quite well. They're, they're, they they're, everyone's loving them. Um, it's a great way to interact on a more personal level with everyone yep. rather than just getting a text reply. Um, yeah, it's quite good. It is. Yeah. Um, and uh, if, if you would like to join, if you hadn't heard of it before and you think that that might be something for you. Yeah, go over um, to our YouTube channel uh, on our homepage and click become a member. Um, or, there's a, or maybe it's a join button, or maybe. there's a join button, yeah. And then and there's if, two and if, sections. One is uh, the Dog Training Academy, Farm Dog Training Academy, and the other one is the Behind the Scenes. Um, and the Training Academy, which is the high one, does include Behind the Scenes. Yeah, it includes Behind the Scenes, but it's more focused around people who want help with their dogs and uh, want actual training techniques and advice and exercises to help uh, train their dogs. Whereas Behind the Scenes is more fly on the wall, um, BLP pass into family life and um, you know everything, everything that behind we do the scenes here at the, the farm, farm and yeah, staff how the business and, works yeah business advice yeah. how we run it uh, future plans that kind of thing um, just trying to think what else with that um, I, it's also a safe place where we discuss things like shadow you know dogs yeah. like you know we we are very open and happy to answer questions um, on all of that stuff. So, um, you know, I don't know, is that? Yeah, no, well, that's, that's where we put it all. Yeah. Because we film everything. We, we walk around all day and film everything. And then um, at the end of the day, we decide on, okay, well, where's this go? Oh, okay, that's a little bit personal. Maybe we'll take that to the behind the scenes or that's technique and, and you know, specific advice. So that goes to the training academy. Um, and then everything else goes uh, public. But um, yeah, and, and that this year that's more focused around our thing is uh, we, we pretty much just wanna let you guys be a fly on the wall and let, let everyone in. Um, and then we just choose what goes where at the end of the day once we've finished all the, all the filming. So yeah, I think that's a pretty big update for everyone. <laughs> uh, we kinda got carried away there uh, with a few different things, but Hopefully, it, hopefully it wasn't. Hopefully, it wasn't too serious. We, but we just wanted to um, have everyone on the same page. Yeah, you know, everyone understand what's going on. Yeah, uh, and um, where we're at, and we're excited about seeing a few comments again and letting everyone get back in touch with that community that we know everyone enjoys. Um, so getting quick, you got twelve hours. <laughs> no, that's not. <laughs> make your comments. It's not true. It's not. They're not all going to be like uh, that. It's, it, it, there will be. There's a bit of a time difference as well because yeah. Know, so here we, in Australia, and it's then not going to be twelve, 12 hours, hours later. Yeah. Um, you know the American followers get on, and that's part of the world. So um, yeah, it'll 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 be for but, enough for everyone to have a chance. to And comment. it might even just be um, possibly even specific to what type of video it is. Yeah. Because we know what videos um, usually attract. Mm. Uh, what more, we've been speaking what about. What we've been talking yeah. about. And so, so it just those might ones, we probably be, won't turn them on at all. Yep, it might uh, be more like that. But we will that. give everyone a chance to, to get on and comment on uh, on some of the videos again. So, and we really Keep appreciate... <laughs> <laughs> we also really appreciate your patience and understanding yeah. on it. And it's been really good. Uh, we even got... Um, the other day, someone, someone sent us uh, a personal gift where, you know, they just felt for us that we were, you know turning comments off because we needed a bit of a break and 
Um, we've got a gift voucher for some oh, chocolates. Yeah. And, um, it was got, anonymous, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah that with was a little lovely. personal note and a couple of so other things. So thank you so, you so much, much for that. To, uh, for, for that, that was really nice. So. Yeah, everyone is quite supportive out there, and we know we've got some really yeah. loyal, dedicated, um, supportive followers, and, and just, we want to keep keep uh, in touch with everyone. So, and just remember, we we are just a husband and wife, yeah. you know, little family living in the country. Yeah. Like we are not, um, you know, we we don't have a professional team or yeah. anything like that. So, you know, um, we are trying our best to to do our best job you know we're, like, we're yeah. just trying to manage we're yeah. trying to um you know do it all the best way we can yeah and this is at the moment how we feel that we can manage this and uh it might be a little bit weird that you know i'm in front of camera <laughs> while sam's talking but um sam's just, still in yeah, her pajamas she's still in her pajamas with her christmas slippers <laughs> So that's why she's just talking behind the camera. I'm so uh, sorry, everybody. Yeah, but I'm going to uh, make sure I grab the camera a little bit more and flip it around <laughs> this year. That was all part of it. But, uh, just but to that's point how out it there. rolls here, yeah, isn't it? It like, is. I'm, yeah. I'm often running out in my pajamas because yeah. there's a truck arriving with sand, you know, yeah. to, yes. like this morning yeah. with the yeah, playground. So I just don't have time to <laughs> with kids and that. Yeah, fair Forgive enough. Forgive me. No, that's all right. Just thought I'd point that out. Let everyone know what's happening behind yeah. the scenes. You know? <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Hope you have a good day. We're going to get back into it and get this puppy playground built and ready to go. Thank you. See you guys.